All right. Before I start, I want to say hi to Mitch. Thanks for tuning in every time I do a video all the way from America. It means a lot. Um, but yeah, I wanted to do a video on, I guess, the types of people that you get um, when you're selling stuff or buying stuff on Gumtree. Sold a lot of stuff and bought a lot of stuff on Gumtree. My um, guitars, this laptop over here, um, my motorbike, sold my motorbike, my other one, all this kind of stuff, but it's a special type of person. Um, for those of you who don't know, Gumtree is like the Australian version of Craigslist. Don't know if Canada has their own version or whatever. Pretty sure it's a Dutch company, interestingly enough. But um, firstly, the most common type of person that you deal with is like, say you list your bike for like three or four grand or whatever, and then you put all the information there, like the specifications, how long you've owned it for, everything you need to know, all the pictures, like more than you need, and your asking price, and then this person will go, I'll take it for one grand cash, no questions asked. And then, like, you just you just have to think about it for a second. You're like, first of all, it's Gumtree. I'm only going to take cash. Like, I'm not a bank. I'm not going to let you take out a mortgage on this whatever you want to do. Like, I'm not taking credit. Like, don't know what you're talking about. And secondly, doesn't cost more if you ask questions. You're allowed to ask questions. It's Gumtree. It's not like... I don't know, somewhere where you're not allowed questions. So, like, no questions asked. All right, this isn't the black market, it's Gumtree. So, I don't know why I get, like, unreasonably mad at people who are like, no questions asked. Ask questions. I've got a lot of free time. <laughs> the second type of person that you meet is always like, Hi, six years ago, my mother had a bit of a fall and has a new hip replacement. Can I please get this bike for one thousand dollars? Like, no, sorry. Unfortunately, your your mother having a fall doesn't really have anything to do with this. But better luck next time. The third type of person is like, I'm free tomorrow at two p.m. And you're like, great, come have a look at it tomorrow. And you give them your address and whatever. And the next day at two p.m., you're like, hey. Just wondering where you are, whatever. They're like, oh, I'm on my way. Full stop. Couple of hours later. Hey, are you okay? Did you get lost? They're like, oh, sorry, I couldn't make it today. <laughs> and you're like, oh, <laughs> cool. <laughs> the next type of person is, so I'll use a guitar for this example. You list your guitar, you're like, it's a Martin DC 16 RE. It's this old 2010. It's got these strings, this pickup, blah, 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 blah. And you get your first message comes in and it's like, hello, my name is Clive. I am from blah, blah, blah. I just wanted to know what brand of guitar is this? What model of guitar is this? What year was it made? It's like, I've answered all these questions. You're the type of person that gets charged more for asking questions. Like, that's the only time I'll charge you more for asking questions is if I've already bloody answered them. Probably my favorite um, person on Gumtree to talk to and deal with is the, um, the students. Um, for example, you're selling a laptop, you're buying a laptop, whatever. You're selling a laptop and they're like, for a thousand bucks or whatever you're doing. And they're like, hi, I am a student. I can only afford to buy this for $500. And you're like, you being a student has nothing to do with this. So I always respond, hello, I am a student also. I can only afford to sell this for $1,000. And that's, that's kind of been my go-to because I don't know how else to respond to that kind of person. The final person that you'll meet on Gumtree is probably the rarest. Um, and be, probably because I'm a dude, this has happened to me very few times and by very few, I mean like one time, um, I was selling like a jumper or something and I thought it was a pretty nice jumper. It's a men's jumper, obviously, but, um, this person was like, hello, has this been worn by a woman? 
Um, yeah, and I just wasn't really expecting that question, so I didn't answer. But um, that's... Yeah, that was an interesting experience for me. But um, yeah, so that's been like kind of a little walk through of some of the types of people that you meet on Gumtree. All super exciting. Um, but uh, yeah, it's selling on Gumtree is is an experience. Um, but that being said, it's much better than selling stuff on eBay. Um, but yeah, thanks for tuning in. And um, I'll probably see you next time. And thanks for watching, Mitch, if you're still watching.